think you know Ninja songs? Old school or new school? Stand a chance to win big on Gusto Guess the Song. To be a part of this, call the numbers on your screen right now. Come on board and let's do things the Gusto way. Hello guys and welcome back again, once again, again and again to Gusto Reactions. And I remain Don Ifeski and I have with me right here, Shei Kubana of Gusto, our, you know, our sponsor. I think they drop money for us, made it a run. Um, a lot of sidegists going here and there about some certain artists, mm. um, you know, missing out on some collaborations and mm. everything and mm. then the para at that time when it happened. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, the artist that David um, mm -hmm. you know, was supposed to, supposed to be on Beyonce's um Lion King album that yeah. dropped back then. Um a lot of people saying that oh maybe this was some reasons. A lot of people even come out to say different things why they feel that David was not that one. Mm. Well, remember David was on an interview with Ebuka, was it this year or last year? Yeah, it was last year. Last year that mm. he talked about the whole thing, how he was paying, you know, having his colleagues be on that one and no one mentioned anything to him. Like he was really pained and then they gave him some lashing. So yeah, mm. right here today is 2021 and then Beyonce could also be working on another project because mm. that one took a year to work on and no one knew about it. Mm. Now we're looking at the possibilities of having David Doe on mm. the next one. Mm. But before we go on that one, David Doe said, I like Beyonce, but she's with Jiga. Jiga. Who is Jiga? Yeah, well, well that's Jay-Z. I like Beyonce, but she's there with Jiga. The band is like, oh, yeah. oh, 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 I get, I get it now. <laughs> yeah. I get it now. Well, the album dropped, getting a whole lot of awards mm -hmm. around back then. Mm -hmm. And this person said, read on this app that Beyonce had a non-disclosure agreement with the artist on the album. Mm. But if David had recorded with her, he would have come to the app to tweet. tweet. Just recorded the biggest song of my career, Africa Be Ready. Queen, thank you. Queen Do B, you agree with you. this? Um, okay, so um, the whole... You know, Beyonce, David Doe, uh, David Doe thing is yeah. quite, uh, you know, it's a straightforward thing. Mm -hmm. An artist wants to record an album. Yeah. And an album that is African themed mm. and decides, oh, okay, let me get Whiskey. Yeah. Let me get Bonner Boy. Yeah, yeah, let me get Sabre, yeah, techno. Yeah, like techno and the rest of them. Mm. Now, there's no reason, number one, there's no reason why, you know, uh, if you're looking, if it's talent, Mm, yet mm. David should be there mm. should be there on that album yeah so definitely it was just a case of preference for Beyonce mm. on okay this song this person will fit more this song this person will fit more mm. so yeah I don't think it was a case of Beyonce not liking David o or a case of non-disclosure yes I know there was a non-disclosure agreement with every artist on the yeah. album this will not record though, you must not reveal anything until it drops. Out, until it drops. Which is normal for every, you know, uh body in the Western world. Yeah. It is in Nigeria where, you know, before yeah. as soon as you record the song, that's in the, don't post in the studio. Snippets. You don't post studio and say coming very soon. Even if it's even if it's coming in one year time, you're posting already yeah. and everything. Yeah. So I think that, you know, for you know, for this one, um it's not about the video revealing. Of mm. course, if David O signs a non-disclosure agreement, he's not going to reveal, mm. you know, that thing. He's not going to come out and say all of this thing now. But but have you look, thinking about it now, David O has had has had a lot of international collaboration with mm. the US and UK guys. Yeah. And then whenever this happened, just looking at it now from past records, mm. David o is always out to say, Yo, I just did this. Mm. He's posted on his story. When he met Drake, we don't even know if there was a song or not. Yeah. He posted. Mm. When him and Chris Brown came through together, he mm. posted. Nicki Minaj, he posted. Yeah. Young Tog, he posted, yeah. and so on and so forth yeah, like that. Yeah. You think anything that made him not to post Beyonce's? Ah, uh, well, see, the thing is, it's the, these things are quite different, you know. Um, Beyonce is on another level. Mm. Now, when um, David o actually got that, you know, Nicki Minaj thing, I know, yeah. you know he posted, and then say, oh, Nicki Minaj, and all of yeah. that. I believe that if you have a non disclosure agreement, mm. David o is going to now, the, 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 the Wahala there. Is that member of his team, a, like a member of his team, mm. would actually now leak the whole thing out and everything? Mm. But I don't believe that's the reason why Beyonce did not put David o on that album in mm. 2019. Mm. I just believe that it was a case of David o, you know, maybe not being available, mm. although he didn't say he wasn't available. 
you get or Beyonce just felt okay none of these songs would fit the David maybe the next one if I want to do another album again, I will call on David. Mm. But from his interview, it sound re- sounded really pain. Yes. Like he now, wished he was, he was on that project. Yeah, of course. Nobody, no, if eh, there's nobody who wouldn't feel pain that your other colleagues are on, you know, an album that is Even people will not reach you. Acclaimed. So to say. And people will not reach you. So to say, you get on that same album and everything. And then you, and it's also pain that if he had heard about it, and wasn't called it would have mm. been a different thing mm. but none of these artists mm. who are supposedly his friends mm. told him mm. that oh i did we did on this album, album. With Beyonce, or we record this album with Beyonce, Beyonce yeah. and everything. but then again you can't blame those people no. they have signed a, a an, an nda mm-hmm. not to reveal if they are revealed to david o breach the contract you breach the contract so that's the thing. So I'm not blaming David O. Yeah. I'm also not blaming the other people. Yeah. I'm also not blaming Beyonce. It was mm. just a case of not being fit for that project. And of course, I'm sure if Beyonce has another project coming up very mm. soon, mm. just maybe she would get David O on it. That's well, David O picks up her call. <laughs> when that one happened, David O congratulated all of them. Congratulations mm-hmm. to my brothers and sisters involved on this project. One for, for the books. The book. Now, looking at very good heart. I mean, David O, very good heart. <laughs> Even if you know you you say oh he's saying it all out of uh, yeah. you know just uh, but the it. fact that he did he has posted it congratulating yeah. everybody we still yeah. drop a album in Lagos like David o is just that guy mm. that would continuously you know um, wish good mm. for that of course we cannot forget this line we rise by lifting others yeah 2021 is almost over just a few weeks to go mm. and then the year is over Beyonce could be cooking another album for next year mm. if he invites David o to be okay oh, David, o? David o, you are the only African artist I want on this project mm. should David o answer the call well see we need to understand that um say with a fight mm. no means say we go fight forever mm. or that I'm pained at some things. David can't be bitter for long. Mm. He can't. I'm sure 2019, I'm sure he's moved on already. Mm. You get from that pain or from whatever disappointment and all that. And I'm sure he's also looking forward to working with Beyonce. Mm. Nobody gets an opportunity to work with Beyonce. Whiskey already did. And Whiskey is getting the you know yeah. the rewards for Ripping it. Reward, yeah. You understand? Mm. So yeah, but for a Bonner boy, Bonner boy might not be getting because of one or two issues, Bonner yeah. and Beyonce and all of that. But a David O would definitely jump on a record with Beyonce. Who is it gonna favor more? David O, who is mm. gonna get the acclaim? David O, who's gonna get the awards and everything? David, if David O get all the awards there are awards that Beyonce has already gotten before. Yeah. With other songs. So, there are no new awards. Exactly. Beyonce to Beyonce. So if David O starts getting a couple of these awards, a Grammy Award, for example, it is him. Mm. Even though we believe that David O can also get a Grammy Award with his yeah, own song. Himself, yeah. Do you understand? But David O would not and should not turn mm. down an opportunity to collaborate with Beyonce because of what happened in the past. Mm. No. You're just going to use the past to hurt the opportunities the for the future. All right. So I believe that David O should please pick up Beyonce's call if Beyonce calls for pick her call. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, should David O pick up Beyonce's call if she Make calls for collaboration mm. for our next body of work? Let yeah. us know in the comment section. Here to reply to some of your comments. I will catch you on the next episode of Costorias. Peace out, guys.